right, guys, welcome back to another update. Thank you for tuning in. Let's get right on into it. Um, I'm taking a look at Mr. Fujian here, seeing what he got going on because, hold on, let's go back here. Let's not move too fast. Because, number one, let me, let me show you some of the things that I look at when I deal with this. Okay, number one. I look at his experience level. He's at a level 16, 17 experience. That's not bad at all. That's pretty experienced. And he's ranked number six in the game. So now I want you to pay attention to something. His his it's very important while I'm looking at his credentials. You have to do that also, guys. Make it a habit. Uh, if you're playing against somebody, check their credentials because you may not want to bother some people. Some people have a lot of experience. So if you got somebody that ain't got but level one, two, three, then yeah. But somebody that's showing you they've been on the game, they know how to play the game, that's what experience tells you is that they're not going to go for some of the more simpler tactics. Okay? And the reason why I'm, uh, um, I'm concerned with Fujian is because... Let me see here. Well, we'll get to that. We'll get to why Fujian becomes important. Right now, as you can see, um, I'm, I'm doing what I need to do as far as conquering the map. I'm leaving my soldiers in place because of South Celeb. South Celeb is over here. He's over here. And you, anybody that has been following this map, you know what I hate. I don't like people in the middle of my nation. So I'm just buying time, building my troops while at simultaneously allowing South Celeb to just do what he feels he needs to do. He's fighting all my guys. He's doing the work for me. Um, because in his mind, we're on the same team. But in my mind, we're not. I look at South Celeb as someone who invaded Australia and who I had to make some diplomatic um, treaties with because of that invasion not because of we were in peace so sometimes you got to make peace with guys and then later on you got to do what you got to do so in the situation with um south celeb i've allowed him to come on to the continent but i'm still moving and doing things in accordance to trying to get this whole continent and um in the process of doing that, we're gonna have to, we're gonna eventually have to remove South Celeb. Um, we still got a little bit of Rockhampton here, a little bit of Port Macquarie, a little bit of probably Gulf up here. So once we get this all wrapped up, then I can put my full attention on getting South Celeb out. Because if you can see up north here, right, if you pay attention. We got people just waiting on my border. And so I have to hurry up, guys, and take care of Australia before any other strong. Now, luckily, I caught South Celeb real quick. But before any strong team or nation tries to invade Australia again, I have to be prepared. So I have really no time. To play with um, with South Celeb. You see, he's using his Zeppelins right here. Now, pay attention to this, guys. This is where I was looking at. This is why I was looking up Fujian because I got Fujian bringing the Navy to me here, and I got North Honshu just sitting here on my border. And their nations is right north above me. And he's bringing quite a bit of troops with him. As you can see, trying to fight it and, and wear it down a little bit with my um, airplanes really didn't do much. So my airplanes are about halfway. Let me show you guys something. Remember I told you. So my airplanes are about halfway full. 
As you can see, they're about halfway full. And that means it's time to pull them out. That means it's time to pull those airplanes out. You don't let them go until they, they get killed. You pull them on out. You let them fight, you let them do a little damage, but then you have to know when to pull your airplanes back. So that's the, and see Fujian, he's right there, very powerful. I do not want Fujian, and he's a part of that coalition, which is in Asia. So we do not need Fujian coming on down to Australia. Absolutely not. So that's why I'm watching him, and he's already got troops in route he's already got troops at my border so i have to hurry up guys it's urgent that i close out australia and, and seal that border this is why i don't trust south celeb because i'm wondering why did south celeb just remove himself from where he was at and came all the way down to where i'm at and now he's bothering me I just find that to be kind of odd. So, no, I don't trust South Celeb. That's another thing. So, I got North Honshu on my border and I got Fujian on my border. So, that is a great concern that's a, and, and that's something that we have to deal with. We got North Honshu here and we got Fujian here. I'm pulling those airplanes back. I'm pulling that Zeppelin back. That was a bad idea to put them Zeppelins out here. Because Zeppelins are going to be very ineffective. When you're talking about attacking boats and troops. They're not that effective. They're Zeppelins. Somebody asked me this question. You still don't know how to use Zeppelins. Zeppelins are not to be mistaken for something that you can attack with. <coughs> Zeppelins are for forts. In buildings is to tear up somebody for it and get that building and tear up their buildings and their infrastructure it ain't gonna do much to any troops and like I said the, if you want to counteract the Zeppelins just get you some fighters Zeppelins are very slow they move very slow so fighters can catch them very easily so you know But this is good work right here. This is good work. So I'm in good position. But I got to move quick. I got to move quick. I got two very formidable individuals right here on my border. And that bothers me. I want to be just left alone. But I can see they don't want to. They, they probably had a goal to come down and get Australia. And I'm interrupting that. I'm the interrupter. All right, guys, so that's where we're at now. Um, so we just entered a new phase of the game. We're trying to close. The, the goal is to try to close out Australia. But like I said, guys, we're going to have to deal with South Celeb. We're going to have to deal with North Honshu. And we're going to have to deal with Fujian. It's inevitable. All right. So let's, uh, I'm going to close it out right here. And um, y'all continue to follow this map. This is a very, very good map. Very interesting map. Um, for those of you who want a tutorial, by all means, uh, like I said, ask questions, guys. I mean, you know, just ask questions if you have a concern and you want to know something. All right. So until next time, guys, I'll catch you later.